We're gonna to talk to you about now the Lemon Cayenne Vitality Drink. This is another really, really good intestinal cleaner. Remember, what do you do to get oil out of your sink? You need to put soap on it. You need to put some type of, of dissolvent on the oil. And so how do you get the intestinal grease, the plaque out of your intestines? Remember the mouth to the anus is 40 feet long. So you can see how John Wayne had over 30 pounds of intestinal mucosal plaque and many people that are just walking around have no less than three pounds to 30 pounds of this stuff called plaque. Now, the easiest way really to see is the plaque is usually there because everything is cemented and stuck. And it has a lot to do with the foods we're eating. So when we stop eating a lot of these foods, a lot of the meats and a lot of the foods that are really, well, that's why you're not supposed to eat, as they say, trans fatty acids or certain types of oils because these types of, of oils turn into plastic. So let's use a solvent that would be totally natural. Some of the people have mentioned this drink as called the Master Cleanse. I've sort of added a few things to it, but the Master Cleanse is good. Let's go over the ingredients. This is the lemon cayenne. Some people call it the Master Cleanse. We've added a few things to it, but in real realism, this is a drink made out of lemon juice, and the lemon juice is just gonna go inside the intestinal tract and really start to clean up the grease. So, main ingredients, organic lemons. Try to use the organic lemons. NPK are regular conventional fertilizers that are fed to conventional foods. So conventional foods means they're usually not what you think they are. They're not nutrient rich. So organic at least means that they're using more minerals than just NPK. So hopefully they're using a variety of minerals that make the food so it actually has why you're eating it, minerals. Cayenne pepper, very smart. Try to always get the hottest BTUs you can. We have about 150,000 BTU, very powerful cayenne. Milk thistle seeds, these are really, really, really cool. Um, they're not expensive and they're very, very healing. A lot of people take milk thistle because it cleans the liver, as a lot of in literature would say. What I say, remember, what you're doing is taking these special items, mixing them up to make it so it actually can, can do the work that you're trying to deaccumulate what you've done in your previous times when you were really unconscious. When you start to eat plastic and synthetics and dead food, well, once you start to really find out that that's not good for you, how do you get it out of you? And that's what this stuff does. We then use a little bit of raw agave, to sweeten it. You can use maple syrup, that's what they say to use in the, in the master cleanse. I like to use the agave because it has inulin. And the inulin, remember, helps feed the intestinal wall bacteria. So this is the simple ingredients, lemons, cayenne pepper, milk thistle seeds, and you don't have to use the milk thistle if you don't want to, but the milk thistle to myself, I mean, really, really, really super cleansing. Um, and the sugar, the agave. And we also have shown you how to make the magnetic blender. So you put all the ingredients in the magnetic blender as we'll show you and whip this thing up. Now, I made this about two weeks ago. This is the drink. Lemon, milk thistle, cayenne, and agave. Now this is two weeks old. I'm gonna try some. Does it go bad? It'll ferment a little bit. Does it taste like maybe if this was pasteurized? This would be rotten. I'm gonna give this a flavor. It smells like lemon. It smells just as good as the day I made it. And this has been about maybe two and a half weeks now. Excellent. You can even put a passion fruit in here, which really gives it like a, a good, like tropical type flavor to it. But I really like the lemons. I try to put in about uh, maybe, oh, 30 ounces of water, about six to eight lemons. The stronger that you, of course, make the solution, the more you're gonna dissolve. So in the beginning, again, remember, go slowly. You don't need to go and do this too quickly. 
You gotta start out slow and see how your body takes a lot of this dissolving. In the beginning, when I started dissolving a lot of the intestinal plaque, I had a lot of stomach aches. I had a lot of feeling of turbulence because a lot of stuff has just fallen apart. So if you do feel that way, you know, remember, you gotta drink a lot of water and you may want, if you have intestinal problems, stop using these liquids for a while and just drink the water. Makes it easy, because these liquids, remember the kombucha, the blue-green algae, the hibiscus flower water, the lemon, the shilajit, these are liquids of vitality, but until you get your vitality, they're actually liquids to transform or terrain modify you to get to that level of vitality. So if you're down here in a lower vitality level and you want to get up here, you can see there's a little stair steps that you have to go up. It's like going up the grades. Once you get here, uh, all you want to do is share how you became vital. We'll see you next time.